Welcome everyone, my name is Michael and today we have test number two of the new hourglass pour. Um, test number one went okay, the painting was fine, uh, we saw some things that we did wrong and today we're just going to make sure we don't do them wrong. Um, I will say I had another pour in mind and these colors have silicone in them and I kind of wanted the hourglass pour to be a silicone less pour but it's okay because we're just running tests and it's more about getting this technique down and working the cup um, so let's clean up okay um, I'll show you the deconstructed version of the hourglass so you can see what you are working with um, so basically it's two parts so you have the bottom cup has a larger hole okay if you can see larger hole <laughs> and the top cup has the smaller hole now they link together like this okay and the concept is like an hourglass you want the paint to drip or flow slower down so it's going to fill up the bottom cup and then as we pour this top cup needs to empty and come down okay that's the whole basis so that's what we're going to work on today hang in there guys um we're going to go through the colors first let's do a quick cleanup because we like to do that a little ritual action here boom let's see how fast we can go today without making a, a huge mess oh pretty fast i do have a titanium white over here okay there we go Oh, only two more coming up and we're done those sticks are out that's always fun for me i don't know that's just me um okay yeah we'll go through the colors while we fill the cup now the key today is to get this cup to stay down because last time it did open up and it started to come out so it's like an open cup pour beautiful cells though all right let's just get going we're gonna go through the colors gonna be awesome here we go we're gonna go to music also as soon as we get done with the first grouping of colors all right so we do want to start out today a little different i want to start out with a pillow base so let's get that in there okay because i want to get this cup to stay down and i think that actually might help all right so pillow base is just a artist loft level one acrylic white and it's just one-to-one -one with the pouring medium keep the smaller hole there and there we go now let's hope that makes a nice seal that we didn't have the first time all right here we go we are going to put just a little bit of our white we just do that just for it and and we are going with titanium white right in the hole we know we have white down there um let's start with the pinks we're going to do a neon pink now, I remember, these right here are gonna spread out, so we're just gonna run through the colors. Next one is light magenta. We're going with magenta. All right, that's in there. We're going with violet. Now this violet is gonna become our connecting color. We're gonna run this through the pinks later on and the blues so it's the color that's going to connect both here is a light blue violet all right there we go a little in there then we're going to do our cerulean blue hue that's in there our thalo blue Right now, we've been through the colors once. I do want to come in with a little bit of the titanium white. Now, I'm pushing down real hard on this cup. It still wants, I know it, I know it wants to come up. So, we're gonna go into some music. I'm gonna fill these cups. I'm gonna tell you first, I'm gonna go blue first. I want blue on the bottom cup. We're gonna do pinks and reds on the top, not reds, magentas on the top. That's how we're gonna layer it. Let's have some fun. Let's go to some music. Here we go.
All right, guys, we are back. We are back. And I kept this cup down. So, yes, you need to throw the pillow down. And you can see, oh, I can't wait. This is going to be great. Oh, see, it's already sneaking out. Okay, so let's see if we can just come up with this. So it's going to drop down like an open cup. Or actually more like a flip cup. But I'll tell you guys, I was looking at it as it's coming down, and it does, it runs just like an hourglass. I'm gonna get a camera down there for you guys so you can see um, that it runs like an hourglass down, and it's actually creating little um, straight force as it's coming down, so it was great. So that's gonna drop down, spread out, then let's see what happens with this top cup. Um, I think I wanna switch to this right hand. I think I have slightly more control. Let's see if we could just come right up, guys. No more talking, let's just go right into it. Here we go. Wow, that was an insane noise there. Let's just get this off right now. Okay. Wow, we have to, you have to lift it up. Oh wait, it's still, is it still dripping? Uh, I don't know, but look, you can see it. It's gonna drip right into my hands, actually. <laughs> see, wow, that's crazy. Let's get this right over here. Bam, yes. <laughs> okay, so the second time we, look at this white, that is insane. But that is like, this is like, I'm sorry guys, I was far away that time. But look at all this weight. And this is like a nice open cup in here. And But look at this. This is that crazy technique, that the pattern that just happens. There's some white drips, there's some stuff going on there. So now it's gonna be interesting because now we have to learn how to, <sighs> we're gonna have to learn how to tilt this and get these cells coming up. Because there's a lot of, this weight is insane. Wow. Wow. Oh, look at these hands are super dirty. Ooh, okay, here we go. All right, let's get some uh, little torch action going on here. Oh boy, here we go. All right, little torch, 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 torch. Let's see some, let's see what's underneath here. Here we go. Ooh, ready, look at this. What is underneath this white, guys? Ooh. Wait till we stretch this out, huh? This should be very interesting. Yeah. Very, very interesting. Let's get that sex center section too. Wow, I love it. Wow, the cell development in this is great. Okay, we like the second, second time. This is very, this is crazy. There's a lot of paint though. So bigger canvas, definitely, or smaller cups. Or maybe don't fill the top up as much. All right. Again, here we go. Let's start the tilt. What do you do here in this situation? Uh, let's go. This has the most space. So let's open this up a little. Oh, guys, look at these cells. This is great. These cells. Hmm. All right. There you go. There's a lot of white. This is a crazy amount of white. What? I did, you know, I did not put that much white. You guys actually saw the amount of white. The amount of white throughout the entire cup was the same as any other color. So this that this it's just got this this paint just got trapped under that initial pillow. So now is that initial pillow a good idea? Let's do a hard tilt right here and see what happens. All right, and then we can come back. See how much we're gonna stretch out. Wow. I wonder what's going on down here though. You see this? What is this? Hmm. Let's do another stretch again. Okay, now the center is better than um, the last one. But this white is crazy. Crazy. Hmm. Hmm. I don't want to lose those cells up top, man. Again, I think we're going. It's almost. It's almost uh, tilting the same way as last time too. For me, at least, I think. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah, the white just was crazy. Okay, so test number two. A lot of white. But let's see what happens. It doesn't just mean it's bad. Okay, we're gonna tilt up that corner. 
So we're gonna bring these cells back. This is, the cells are just ginormous. Okay, now remember too, old guys, we have that silicone in, so way more cells this time than last time. I mean, the cells last time were like, the cells actually last time were similar to these. So the bottom cup is gonna produce the same cells regardless. It's just figuring out what this top cup. See, now that top cup just took super control. And see, look, there's not a lot of white in the top cup because this whole pattern right here is the top cup. Look, all this red and magentas, that's the top cup. Okay. I'm just tilting it a little down. Just coming down a little. I'm gonna stretch everything out and see what we get. It's nice, it's very bright. The top cup really was out of control this time. So, okay. So now we know. Okay, second test. Very easy. Watch out for the white, but the white's gonna develop some awesome cells, which we probably would rather have than a majority of this top cup. So maybe less on the top part of the hourglass, more, and uh, I think that's okay. Even the white pillar wasn't too bad. These cells over here are so nice. I wanna bring them back. That actually looks really nice, guys, look. I don't know why I'm whispering, but I figure that's kind of fun. All right, we're having a fun night. Yeah, I really wanted to do something crazy like a uh, like a four cup uh, open cup and just have the, just fun and wild craziness, but uh, I really wanted to get through this test again. So now we're gonna stretch back a little. Sorry with the stretching, but I just wanna see what, what we can develop out of this painting too. Because there is a ton of red on this one side. Magenta, I keep saying red, it's magenta. All right, we got the, now, all that work we just did with the tilting to bring those cells back in, we just lost. That middle is moving a lot, so that's good. All right, let's go with this. I'm gonna stick with this composition, I think. How are we doing with the bottom? We didn't really do a lot of, I give a lot of love to the bottom. There we go. I think we like it. Let's go with this composition, guys. All right, test number two. All right, wait till we torch, I think. Let's let's clean up and we're gonna torch on camera and it'll be nice. All right, give me a second. We would hate to just drip random paint. We look, at, look at the cells developing right now, even as we sit here. This is great. It's gotta be that pillow, that pillow, man. That pillow helps. Now Artisan level one. Acrylic is really good. <clears throat> All right, look at this little torch action. We go with the big torch. We don't need the little torch today. We want to stick with these big cells. Crazy eye cells. Sometimes they're staring at you. Oh, I love it. Oh, the cells in the white. Let's see if we get some more cells over there. This is great. Oh, this painting is super full of cells. I guess thank you, silicone, on top of the normal action that we were getting. So, all right. That was fun. Test number two. We will see you later. I'm a mess. Ooh, I'm going to go clean up. And bye.